hello guys and welcome back to my channel so the point of today's video is to talk about my journey on youtube so this month has actually been a year since i've been on youtube i think that my first video would have been like between september 15th and the september 20th so yes it has been a year since i've been on youtube and it went so fast i was just looking at my previous videos and the reason i know it was coming soon is because i know it was close to my um my school's homecoming. I'm an alumni of Morgan State University, and yeah, I know it's coming up soon. So I was like, I think it's been a year since I've been on YouTube, and I checked, and it has been. This has been an amazing journey. I just want to thank everyone who has been supporting my channel. This has been really, really, really exciting. You know, to um, I can remember from day one when I started. You know, wondering what was I going to talk about. You know, how people respond to me, and it's exciting. You know, I almost have 300 subscribers now. Um, that may be small to some, but you know, I, when I first started this channel, and I'm gonna include the video of my first welcome to my channel video, I'm gonna include that down in the info bar. When I first made the channel, and you have to stay focused with that, I said, if I only can help one person, that's good enough for me. And that's what it is. You, of course, it's, like, it's nice to reach out to more people and have more um, you know, subscribers that actually wanna view and hear what you have to say. But if I'm helping one person, that's enough for me. You know, people have, you know, when they tell me on Facebook, you know, you help me with my lipstick or you help me with makeup or, you know, that was really encouraging what you said to me. That means a lot to me, you know, because we need more people in the world who just want to help people to help. And that's what I want to do, you know. I like being, someone was there as an outlet for me when I was going through when I first started my channel. And I want to do that for somebody else. I want to just pass it along. So, you know, I have really enjoyed this channel. You know, you guys, um, have um you know shared things with me and you know i appreciate you guys um you know just sticking with me you know because I'm, I'm new to this and i'm still you know every day learning the ropes I, I did one giveaway so far on my channel and yes another one will be coming up um since it's been to celebrate in honor of my one year here on youtube i'm definitely going to be doing that and i'll give details on that in a little while um first i want to talk about things that um I want to improve on my channel. I definitely want to, it'll be nice to reach out to more viewers and get more subscribers and people that actually, you know, talk to me. That's one of the main things. I want people to like, you know, talk to me and um, ask me questions. I don't get that a lot. Every, you know, I have a few um, faithful subscribers that I really, really, really appreciate you guys who ask me questions and let me know that I'm helping you. But I understand some people, you know, just watching, they don't want to comment because when I first started watching YouTube, people that I look up to, I really was just a viewer. I didn't never see much in the comments, so I totally, you know, understand that. Some people just want to view, and that's it. But I just want to make sure that, you know, I'm, I'm putting out stuff that, you know, you guys enjoy seeing. So, um, as I always ask, please, if there's some videos that you want to see, please share with me. So far, what I've been doing on my channel is, of course, I do beauty, and I do um, outfit of the day as far as fashion goes. Um... And for us, fitness, I try to get fitness tips. Um, you know, I used to do Weight Loss Wednesday when, when I started my channel out now. I have actually started um, Fit Fridays. So I get fitness tips and I talk about, you know, what I'm trying to improve on myself and give updates on my fitness journey. So hopefully that's motivating some. I try to do that. And um, yes, I also like to do girl talk and um, I say strawberry letters. If anyone's familiar with the Steve Harvey Morning Show, People write in about problems that they're going through in their family or relationship and he kind of gives their feedback on it. I love doing that kind of thing. I actually made a video and asked anyone and that still goes on. If you have any issues that's happening with your family, friends or anything like that that you would like someone's feedback on and you can just send that to my inbox so you can stay anonymous. You know, If you like, I will not put your name out there. Just tell me what you're going through and I can get my insight on it. Also, I like to do girl talk where I talk about, you know, women needing to know their worth. I'm very, very, very big on women knowing their worth and sticking to you know knowing that they deserve better knowing there's a king or a queen for you um, gentlemen out there waiting for you you know you don't have to settle and just think that um you have to lower your standards just to have someone i definitely always want to key in that also you know i'm a christian i'm not a perfect christian um by no means but i am christian and um you know i, I love the lord and i know my help comes from so a lot of times if like the enemy tries to attack me in some way I'll come on here and I'll give my testimony. You know, I try to get some scripture to you guys. So someone else, I know the devil's on our track all the time. And someone else may need that encourage your word. Because there's many days, I don't care how much you pray or what you're doing in your life, you're going to figure out. You know, I'm a pre preacher's kid. Both my mom and my stepdad are preachers. And, you know, as a kid, I had to go to church all the time. I'm talking about sometimes six days a week. 
And I hated it then, but now I'm really, really glad that as a kid, my parents kept me in the church because I didn't know, I didn't realize what a great foundation that would set me up for. So many times in life when I'm going through things, you know, if it wasn't for that knowing that I can go in the Bible and find a scripture or when I feel like my load is so heavy, I can turn and think about the scriptures of Job, how God said he was a perfect man, you know, that is the only man that God said in the Bible that was perfect. I love the story of Job, not the preacher, you guys, and how, you know, he was perfect and God still gave him trials, you know, to allow the devil to test his faith. So, you know, things like that really encourage me because sometimes, you know, someone just tries you at the right minute and you just feel like you want to burst. And, you know, I'm not trying to force religion on no one, but let me just tell you, you are missing out. You're missing out if you don't love the Lord and have him on your side. So, yes. Those are things that I talk about on my channel. So I just told you things that I want to improve on. I definitely want to be able to communicate more with my viewers. And I want them to share things that they would like to see um, from me. Those are things that I would definitely... Um, I think I like want to, to encourage anyone. If you're thinking about, you know, starting a YouTube channel, go ahead and do it. You know, when I started my YouTube channel, of course, and um, someone asked me like, oh, what are you going to do if someone says something negative to you? I said, more than likely, just what I do in everyday life, I'm not going to respond, you know? I don't care if you like what I'm presenting. If you love it, I'm really glad you want to join in. But you know, as my mom always told me, one well, monkey don't stop no show. The show must go on. If you don't like it, change the channel. I'm not going to be mad if you don't view me. You know, you can't please everybody. The most important person you got to please, please in this life is yourself. So keep that in mind. Do not get caught up in the fact, you know, that you don't get any views. I can remember when I started my first video and I would go and look and see if anybody watching my video. And I remember that first video, I think it was like an outfit of the day when I got like 300 views. And I was just like, wow, you know, 300 people out here that I don't even know took the time to watch me. They were super excited. So you get your small victories. Just keep working with it. You know, try to reach out to some people that's on your level because I will let you know a lot of people that have more subscribers. There's some people out here, unfortunately, who they really think that these subscribers are their friends or that people, um, you know, they're, they're um, on cloud nine because they have a lot of subscribers. Well, I have one subscriber, 100 or 10,000. You know, I'm going to be just like this because, you know, the bottom line is I don't know you guys, unfortunately. I would love to someday get up on an area where I can meet some of you and get to know you. That's great. But I'm not going to think, um, you know, anymore because I had one or one ten thousand. I did learn that that you know you would reach out to some of them, you know, say hello, come in, you know, check out my channel, and some of them, you know, don't even respond. But like I said, one monkey don't stop no show. The show must go on. If you want to start a YouTube channel, just get that in your mind. You know, do you boo? At the, at the end of the day, you know, if you want to do something, you go out there and you do it. You know, and you be and you make sure you do it to the best of your knowledge. You know, get you a camera and get you some lighting and you go for it you know as long as you, you'll get better as you go along you know my videos have gotten better i can go back and look at my old ones and i see improvements for myself so just keep trying to improve reach out to others on here that like has the same amount of subscribers as you and people a lot of some people that's you know on your level is not gonna um support either but that's all right the show must go on just give it a shot and see if you like it M me frankly this is my outlet i enjoy it. this is like one of my hobbies you know I love pictures, fashion, I love, you know, encouraging people. I've always loved encouraging people. And this channel allows me to do that. So I'm loving it so far. So, um, okay. Yes, guys, let's talk about the giveaway. So the giveaway is actually going to be um, a gift card is what I'm going to decide to do. Now, I haven't decided if it's going to be a gift card to H&M or Forever 21, but it will be one of those stores. Um, the reason I thought about, I, I love Forever 21, especially for, for women because they're very, you know, reasonable. So is H&M, but um, I know Forever 21 has a men's section now. I was thinking about doing male or, you know, H&M because it has more of a male selection. I'm not sure how good the females, I mean, the um, the male selection is coming at some Forever 21. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm just going to say it's either going to be a gift card, so either or Forever 21 or H&M. It's gonna be a $25 gift card to one of those stores. And so, uh, one thing that you have to do in order to win this, you must, for one, be a subscriber to my channel. You have to subscribe to my channel and you must um, follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is Phenomenal Beauty. So you have to be a subscriber on my YouTube channel and you must follow me on Instagram. The next step of this is down in the comments I want you to tell me um, what fashion or beauty item 
um, really makes you feel like you got it together. You know that piece in your closet that you may be having a bad day or anything and you can just put that on and can't nobody tell you shh, okay? Can nobody tell you nothing. <laughs> when you put that on, you put your head in the air and you have it going. Um, that's what I wanna hear about. What's that item that no matter how much of a bad day, you can put it on and you know, you feel good. Um, for me, um, the item, let's go, um, for me, of course, my makeup. I love putting my makeup on. When I put my makeup on, I take my time with it. I try to, you know, get it precise as possible. So when I make up this face, yeah, I'm already, you know, I'm feeling great. That's my extra mm. Um, and for the item of clothing, I'll have to say a dress. Probably a, a casual, um, like black dress. I like that. I think that um, black is one of those things who, you know, everyone should have black items in their wardrobe. Me, I get on like a little simple black dress. I like the fact that I can like dress it down with some sandals for the daytime, or I can throw a blazer on it with some pumps and take it to the night. So yeah, um, preferably a bodycon, like casual dress. I love bodycon. I'm a very big fan of bodycon items. So yes, that's what does it for me. So as I said before, you have to subscribe to my channel. You have to like me on Instagram at Phenomenal Beauty. You have to follow me on Instagram, I mean. And you have to leave that in the comments. Tell me the beauty I fashion item that really, you know, gives you a boost of confidence and make you feel great when you put that on. Simple rules to the contest. I want to thank you all again for supporting my channel. I really, really do appreciate it. You know, it uh, has been a great journey for me. Thank you for allowing me to share you know, my daily life activities and things that I like with you. If there's any things you would like to see, as I said before, please um, feel free to leave them down below. Thank you guys so much. Mm -hmm. Talk to you soon.